Want to speed up your Airtable use? In this video, I'll teach you a bunch of handy keyboard shortcuts that are sure to quicken your workflow. We'll learn how to swiftly navigate your bases, copy and paste records, search through new views, and way more. If you're using a Windows operating system, you'll want to use the Control key instead of the Command key for relevant shortcuts. In the on-screen instructions, you'll see that we've listed both Command and Control in those instances. And if you ever want to see all of Airtable's shortcuts, just press Command Backslash to call up the full menu. Now, let's go through some of the most useful shortcuts together. You may be familiar with this one already, but typing Command Z will undo an action made in your base. So if I accidentally create a new record, I can simply press Command Z to remove it. Command Y will redo your last action, so I'll press that now to recover the record. I can use Command P to print my current view. If I expand a record, I can press Command P to print this record specifically. Command Shift K opens the view switcher, allowing me to switch to any view within the current table. Command J brings up the table switcher. This is an easy way to toggle between the tables in my current base. If I want to switch to a different base entirely, I can press Command K to open the Quick Base Switcher. This shortcut works both when I'm on the home page and when I'm inside a base. There are also a number of shortcuts that can be used to customize your views. Let's say that I want to create a new filter in one of my views. I can press Command Shift F to open the filter menu. Command Shift D opens the grouped records menu and Command-Shift-S opens the sort menu. Pressing Command-Shift-Backslash will toggle the blocks panel open or closed. If you want to search through records in a view, press Command-F or Command-G. When you're through with your search, press Escape to close the find bar. If you have a date time field in your base, you can input the current time by pressing command semicolon. Some keyboard shortcuts are unique to the different types of views. In a grid view, for example, pressing Shift-Enter will insert a new record below the selected cell. Another useful shortcut in grid view is Command-C, which will allow you to copy one or more cells. Now, to paste this information, I simply click on the cell where I want the text to go and press Command-V. You can also cut information using Command-X. This is handy if you want to remove information from one cell and paste it into another. This function follows the same rules as copying and pasting. Another handy shortcut to use in grid view deals with expanding records. If you click on any cell in a record and press the space bar, the entire record will expand. To move to the previous or next record, press Command, Shift, and the greater than or less than signs. When you're ready to close the record, just press the escape key. If you just want to expand an individual cell in a record, select the cell and press Shift, Space. You can then use the arrow keys to move to different cells. Again, using the Escape key will collapse the expanded cell. If you want to edit a specific cell, select it and then press Enter or the F2 key. There are also a number of shortcuts that can be used to navigate through your grid view. For example, pressing the Function key with the up or down arrows move you up and down in the view. To scroll to the left or right, select a cell and use Alt, Option, and the up and down arrows. To jump to the edge of a table, select a cell and press Command and an arrow key. If you want to select all the cells between the cell you've selected and the edge of the grid, simply add the Shift key to this function. So if I select the first cell in a record and press Shift, Command, and the right arrow key, I will automatically select every cell in the record. Alternatively, I can simply use Shift and the arrow keys to select any number of cells I like without jumping to the edge of the table. In any gallery view, you can easily scroll to the edge of your gallery by using Command and the up or down arrow keys. In Kanban view, the left and right arrow keys will scroll the board to the left or right by a single stack. You can scroll to the edge of your board by pressing Command and any arrow key. If you ever need to be reminded of these shortcuts, simply press Command Backslash at any time while using Airtable, 
and a menu with every shortcut will appear. And remember, these shortcuts are also available on our support pages, where you can reference them at any time. Thanks for watching!